feels like we've been flying around forever. Where is this Kunlun place anyway? Hey, Visco, help me out here, will ya? Unfortunately, location unavailable. Is what? If you can't do something that simple, how can I depend on you for anything? Come on, what did you expect? We can't find this place on any map in the world. With good reason. Hmm? Hmm? Kun Lun happens to be the world's last and greatest hidden city. Why are we going to this secret place anyway? Because we've arranged a meeting with Iron Fist. You've got to be kidding me. Really? The Iron Fist? The hero with fists of iron? The guy who can smash through anything? He has something important he wants to share. So he contacted Iron Man, who in turn sent us. Guys, do you know what this means? Tony finally realizes how good we are and wanted to give us a legit mission. I knew it! We're finally part of the team! Whatever this meeting's about, the future Avengers won't let him down. Let's do this! <laughs> The city of Kun Lun is within this structure. Amazing! An entire city is inside these walls! I love it! Hey, it's Thor! And he looks as brave as always. You've been here before, I take it. Many a time. <gasps> oh man, these are the cutest! Just the thing for a girl like you. Really? That smell! Now I'm hungry! He looks so delicious! Would you like to try some? Really? Any friend of Thor's is a friend of Kunlun. Thanks a lot! Oh, this is gonna be so good! Man, that's spicy! <laughs> Maybe it's just too much for a child like you. No way, this is nothing! It's not spicy, it's super delicious! Dude, take it easy. Shall we continue our adventure? <laughs> What you see before you is the most sacred place in all of Kunlun. Looks spooky, like it's haunted. Whatever, ghosts don't scare me. Huh? <clears throat> no need to panic. Greetings. Welcome to Kunlun. Uh, who's? Is that Iron Fist? What an aura. I feel it just as mightily in you as your predecessors. Thank you, but I still consider myself in training. These are the kids Tony mentioned, I take it? Indeed. Oh, this is really happening. I'm Makoto, and we're the future Avengers. I gotta say, it's an honor to meet you in person. My name is Adi. I'm Chloe. The future Avengers, I get it. The pleasure's mine, I am Iron Fist. <laughs> This news is something I feel you'd better hear directly from the Elders. They are deep in meditation at the moment. However, we can meet with them tomorrow. There's another thing I'd like to discuss. More of a favor, actually. I and the other Avengers were hoping you could train these three personally. What? Hold on a second. You mean that's the reason you brought us along? It should prove quite beneficial to train with someone like him. Iron Fist is a master martial artist. Huh? You've got to be kidding! I thought this was a real mission and we were going to help Iron Fist rescue his master or something. You know, like facing a bunch of super villains at the top of some ancient building. We'd start at the first floor, fighting hundreds of minions as we made our way upstairs, facing stronger guys on each floor until we reached the boss at the top, right? You've seen too many kung fu movies. And here we do our own stunts. <clears throat> oh, man. You better get some sleep. We begin training tomorrow. Your training begins now. This is training? Seems more like cleaning. Wait, 
You're kidding, right? We have to scrub this whole place? We'll polish and purify the ground upon which you stand wholeheartedly. The basis of any training. What? This isn't kung fu at all. And begin! <laughs> Okay, no more cleaning for this life. This is easy. I could do this all day. Well, the floor looks good as new. Now I want you to go and draw water from the river. Then pour it into that jug until it's full. Uh -huh. You mean this giant thing? Fill it up? I understand each of you has special abilities, but for the sake of your training, their use is forbidden. <laughs> I don't think we need our powers to scoop up some buckets of water. Good. So, uh, where is this river anyway? The heart of the mountain. A little over six miles from here. Six, six miles? miles? <laughs> this is crazy! Look at this trail! <sighs> Not sure I'd call this a trail. And it gets worse at every turn! Even so, it's better than scrubbing the floors. I'm not so sure about that. <laughs> now we gotta tackle the trail again carrying this? Yep. Time for Aerial Act Type 8. Flight! Hey, no using your powers, remember? I recall someone saying they wouldn't need to use them for scooping up water. All right, then, fine. You're back sooner than I expected. <laughs> no sweat. It was nothing. Here you go. Uh, uh, huh? You'll have to go back. <laughs> Wait a sec! You already have water! You've had a vision. That we did. A dark and troublesome one we received during our meditations that we felt must be shared with you. That is the reason we had Iron Fist summon you before us. What did you see that has you so ill at ease? A terrible power that engulfs the world in darkness. The evil will descend upon this planet on the billows of dark green clouds. And only a short time after, cursed rains will drench the world in despair. Billows of dark green clouds. Cursed rains, dark green clouds of evil, terrible power, darkness. Could it be? Is this about the Emerald Rain Project? It is possible. We feel the connection must be looked into. Hmm. What can be done? Can we prevent this evil? A light to illuminate the darkness will soon come. A light? And that light will become powerful enough to guide the future of this planet. For now, that light still remains feeble and weak. A feeble light to guide the future. Now you'll face me. Don't hold back. I am ready. Come at me with everything you've got. You need to relax. Don't be so stiff. Feel the energy flow through you as you punch. Makoto, Chloe, Spar. Choose your weapon. Guess I'll take these. This looks fine to me. Are you both familiar with your weapon? Mine's just a plain old stick. Easy enough. <laughs> what about you, Chloe? Uh, I think I can manage these. Then let's begin. All right, think fast, Chloe. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta say, I kinda like these things. <laughs> Whoa. Game over. Lucky, I want a rematch. So you can lose two times, boom. Don't be so cocky. He just caught me when I had my guard down for a second. It won't happen again. 
a light that still remains feeble and weak. I'll beat you for sure tomorrow, in 10 seconds. Try in 10 years, maybe. Time to get up, Makoto. Uh, just 10,000 more minutes, okay? Uh. Option activate! <laughs> Where's the snooze button? Wake up already, you lazy bones! I'm up now. Ouch. Okay. Stupid Tony, I should have known he'd throw in a function like that. Get up now! Wakey, wakey! Put a sock in it already! <clears throat> no more shocky, just more sleepy. Come on, didn't you hear me? I said a few more minutes. Stop nagging me! Yeah. If need be, I can arrange a more intense shock to wake you up. No, no, it's fine! Look, I'm up, okay? <laughs> Listen, it's not that I don't appreciate it, but why do I need personal training? Correct me if I'm wrong, but it seems you have no interest in practicing martial arts. From my experience, good training requires a change of scenery from time to time. You are standing in Kunlun's largest orchard. Help me with the harvest. And that's part of my training? Indeed, don't let me down. Uh, yes, sir. Makoto, I want you to change the direction of the waterfall's flow from bottom to top. Say what? I can't do that, it's impossible. Is that so? Of course, how could anyone do it? Even my aerial axe can't pull off something like that. If you're completely convinced that you are incapable of something, your doubt will make that thought true. <sighs> okay, fine, you win. I'll give it a try. Aerial axe type 8, fight! Aerial axe type 1, go! Impact, fly! <laughs> See, told you, it can't be done. The art and effort of turning the impossible into possible is what training is all about. One more time, and begin. <sighs> Unbelievable, changing the flow of the waterfall. I didn't see him do that. Man, I don't know about this training. How'd it go for you, Adi? Well, so-so, uh, I guess. All right. We see that dragon everywhere in town. Is he their mascot or something? Xiao Lao, the immortal dragon. Huh? Oh, immortal. That's right. Since ancient times in Kunlun, only he who defeats Xiao Lao proves himself the greatest martial artist and is awarded the title of Iron Fist. Wait, does that mean you beat him? I challenged him and defeated Xiao Lao, one of the few to do so. Then I dipped my arms in Xiao Lao's melted heart. By completing this undertaking, I obtained fists of iron that carry his power, as well as the title of Iron Fist. Many martial artists have tried and failed to defeat him. Their attempts are honored. Those statues surrounding Kunlun are to appease the souls of those warriors. Hmm. After all that training, I bet you were super happy when you finally became Iron Fist, huh? I had a sense of accomplishment, but there was no feeling of joy. It was heavier than that. What do you mean? Burdened with the weight of having power. The most important thing to remember is that once you obtain power, you do not allow yourself to be consumed by that power. tried this, can we stop already? You're giving up then? Listen, dude, waterfalls fall from top to bottom, okay? You can't change something like that, it's how they work! You cannot change the flow of the water as you are because your heart is only facing one direction. What do you mean? I don't understand. Tell me, Makoto, why do you want power? What would you use it for? Good question. I guess I want to use it to defeat evil. Whether or not it can be handled properly depends heavily on the heart of its user. Listen to me. True training is about finding the flow of a strong heart and going with it, and learning to adapt. Once more, and begin!
A way that suits me. The flow of a strong heart. Adi, Chloe, and Makoto. You think they can become lights that will help guide the future? They have what it takes. The important question is, how will they use the power they gain? That is a tough one. It's something that can't be taught through words. It must be learned through action. Souls of those who fell, failing to achieve greatness. It is time to claim your vengeance. Now, Rai Shaolau, awaken and fly! Shaolau, my obedient servant, go wreak havoc to your heart's content! That noise, what is it? That is not the roar of a common beast. Uh -oh. What's going on? What is that? I don't believe this. It's Shao Lao. Oh, dragon, dragon. Oh, why would he attack us? Help the citizens evacuate to safety. You, you got, got it. it. Why is he doing this? I thought that dragon was the protector of Kunlun. Of course. But that's not our Shao Lao. Oh, hurry! You have to get outside! Quick, this way! Not good. Who are they? <laughs> All right. That's as far as you're gonna get. You guys ready? <laughs> now, future Avengers assemble! Oh, time for aerial act type eight. Fight! Type zero double impact! Oops. <laughs> Look out! Mm. Oh, you have weapons attached to your boots! Oh. You should use them! Oh, wow! Uh. Uh. fast. Uh. Uh. These things sure come in handy! <laughs> Type zero, double impact! Uh. 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 I almost hurt those people. Ah! Unleash the Shining Fist! Feel my Mjolnir Bash! What's this? An evil deceptive presence I've felt before. It's Enchantress! It seems our paths have crossed again, my dear Thor. A sorceress who sullies the good name of all Asgardians. You pursued me all the way here, when will you give up? I'd hold off using that lightning strike right now, son of Odin. Wouldn't want to endanger these innocent bystanders, would you? <sighs> you heartless coward! Oh, you flatter me, as always. You know, you've defeated me time and again in the past, but it seems that I am the victor this round. And after I take care of you, those troublesome elders will be next. Leave them out of this. Your arrival can't just be a coincidence. You must be involved with the Emerald Rain Project. Oh, wouldn't you like to know? But alas, that shall remain a mystery for now. Nevertheless, I need any who get in my way gone. We must get this dragon away from here! I will not let anyone disgrace the sacred dragon Shao Lao in this way! Thor! Uh, Iron Fist! Oh no! This isn't some primitive parlor trick. No, this is bad. No matter what I do, I'm no help to them. What am I doing? My powers... I... Makoto, there is more than one way to use your powers. More than one? What does he mean by that? You cannot change the flow of the water because of your heart. Right now it only faces one direction. Only one direction. 
Change the flow. More than one way to use my powers. Shaolau, burn them all! Leave no one alive! I see now. Yes, this is my heart and my new power. That's right. Aerial Act, Type 10, now bind! Strike! Now you fall, false idol! Taste these fists of iron! Spiral shining fist! Makoto, Chloe, Adi. Like the rainbow you see before us, you must become a bridge. A bridge to the future. Be a bridge to the, to the future. future. That's right. Future Avengers. Your destiny awaits. Yeah, you can count on us. Future Avengers train their bodies as well as their minds in Kun Lun, bringing them one step closer to becoming real heroes. But something seems to be bothering Adi. He recalls the atrocities committed when he was a Hydra agent. Then he learns about all the things that happened to Tony Stark before he became Iron Man. On the next episode of Marvel's Future Avengers, Secret Past of Iron Man. Catch the Future Avengers!